Hey guys, back with another video. Today, as you can see, there is a receipt that has been taped, so there's no numbers or anything besides the pricing. There's no like phone numbers, is what I'm trying to say. So it's the Dollar Tree that you could make an aquarium with or a hamster cage. So as you can see, it says document frames. Now document frames have glass on them. And um, yeah, and you can make an aquarium with using the glass. Instead of paying extremely high prices at PetSmart, $72 was one of them. And that was just a normal size. And I also have this other type. It's a special type, but this is gonna be the base. As you can see, it's just um, a giant photo on it. It's a picture frame, but it's giant. So I'm gonna be taking out the pictures and stuff. And it's the certificate of achievement one. I'm gonna take them out. And I'll sh I'm gonna show you how to do that in the first one and then I'm gonna speed it up so you guys don't have to wait so what you're gonna need is some pliers because there's metal um, things that you would have to bend to get it out so you would need a needle nose pliers and just do that and then bend it up it's pretty simple so I'll come back with you when I'm done with all of them So um, I just finished one of them. Um, as you can tell, this um, needle nose plier is a thicker one. So it was hard to bend all the metal things. So as you can see, all of them are bent. So I can now take out stuff. So there's the first thing, it's the brown. And then here's the Certificate of Achievement. And this is what you get, a glass frame. And this is real glass. So we're gonna keep it in the frame because the aquarium needs a frame. Then we're gonna bend back down the things. And then here's one of them. Here's one of the sides. So yeah, that's one out of five. Okay. So I'll be right back with you when I'm done finishing all of them. I just realized that the um, whole clip thing and how you'd have to use the needle nose plier well, I used my fingers and it was much easier, but some of the tabs fell off. That's probably because I got it from the dollar store, but yeah. Oh, and if you want this as an actual aquarium to hold water, you'd have to glue in the frames to the frame, or the glass to the frame. And that's still pretty simple. It just uses a little bit more glue. So yeah, now, what we're gonna be doing is starting up the hot glue gun. So yeah, I'll see you guys when it's ready. Hey guys, I'm back. So right now I'm going to be doing the hot glue and yeah, so it's heating up. So yeah, I'm going to be coming back and a little bit when it's fully heated and actually glue it. So, yeah.
basically I glued them all so that to the point where um, the glass won't move at all. It's not waterproof because I only did certain dots. I didn't really do it that much. But um, yeah, I burnt myself. <laughs> it didn't hurt, but um, yeah, I got a third degree burn. It instantly killed the skin. So, um, <laughs> yeah. So anyhow, now I'm going to be doing the gluing of the aquarium. So the aquarium is going to be done in the next few minutes. <laughs> um, yeah. And if you saw my hand moving, like, in circles or something or waving it, that was just because I was trying to get the um, strings of glue away. Before I start, I just want to tell you the um, decorated side should be um, pointed up to the sky because... Um, so your pets can't chew the glue that's on the other side. So like this is gonna be the inside. to have my dad help me because I couldn't hold them both together while I hot glued it or I would get burnt so I finished and it's actually really sturdy and that's how you get a glass aquarium if you just do the glue job a little bit better like I didn't mind horrible but if you do it a little bit better it, it could support water and everything so yeah now i'm gonna come right back um after i fill it full of hamster bedding and stuff like that and i'll try and put my hamsters in it and see what it looks like So I can't figure out how to put this toy on, but I'm gonna try something and I'll be right back. Hey guys, what's up? We just finished and I'm so excited. So um, here's Squeaks, my other hamster. And this is his new home. So yeah, he upgraded. So yeah. So yeah, the cage works awesome. So this can work for any pets. So, so yeah, besides cats and dogs and bigger animals, obviously. But yeah, look, he loves it. He's going right into his little house. It's awesome. So he has corn of the cob, toys, water, and all sorts of stuff. He likes going underneath tables, apparently. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed, comment, like, and subscribe, and bye guys!